Hey guys, welcome to a Cascade Gaming Path of Exile video. You guys know the rules. No guides, no walkthroughs, no instructions, no wikis, no YouTubes. Basically just taking advice from the community. So in this episode, we are looking at doing the Fairgraves quest. So Captain Fairgraves has sent us, sent us on a quest to capture a slave girl who's stolen a flame from his boat. Honestly, he seems like a little bit of hmm how do i put this a not so nice person so i'm kind of wondering if we're going to get a double cross at the end okay let's head in stay tuned oh okay so this is going to be a quest run captain fairgraves Frankly, i would have been surprised if you hadn't recognized him yes tis i captain sigmund fairgraves. i have no idea who this guy is but he thinks that i should know who he is conveyor of civilization barbaric lands. So what am I doing here? Apart from blowing my own bugle? He's marooned. I'm marooned. Languishing thanks to a pair of pretty blue eyes. Oh, someone with pretty blue eyes. The filthy mud of Rayclart. Makes me quite salty, this slave girl. I liberated her from the flesh <laughs> Oh, no. She used her used her wiles and uh, and snagged all his stuff at, while she escaped. Look, she was a slave, so I I kind of get why she'd be, you know, trying to do whatever she can to escape and make a, a better life for herself. So, Captain Fairgrave. Fairgraves, I think you might be a little bit of a a little bit of a not nice person. Oh, um, oh! Don't look at the map at the moment. Cass, look at other stuff. Whoa! There's a whole heap of all of the everything going on right now. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! I feel so powerful. I f I'm just like, I have all the power. Yes, power. All right. But it is, so I think I've got to increase. I must have to increase all of my pirate's treasure. Scroll of wisdom. Oh, there are many pirates here. Light of Brigandine. Is that what we were supposed to get? The Drunken Corsair. Okay. Look here, Mr. Drunken Corsair. Or Ms. Drunken Corsair. Whoa! We just hit the jackpot, you guys. Alright. Town portal scroll. Back to Lion's Eye. Offload. Oh my god. We hit the jackpot! Um, oh, we can level up all right, so let's um, head into the ship graveyard cave and see what's what in the ship graveyard cave. Okay, so this is where the all flame is. And maybe the siren is in the same, like the same general area as um, the sort of the, you know, escape from uh, find another way into the forest. Deal. Things in here do not like fire. I suppose everything's like watery, so not liking fire makes a lot of sense. And ghosts aren't supposed to like fire in general, are they? I don't know. Maybe I'm j maybe I'm just like making up general ghost law. It's like hmm. According according to the law, ghosts don't like fire. You know what? According to the law, most things don't like to be set on fire. But this, I think, has taken it to a new level. Look at this. Everything. Everything is just like, why am I being set on fire? I hate this. It's like, yeah, that's right. Because I am powerful. Here is you. Fathom Scream. Extra life. Hinder Aura. Okay. Seems like, uh... Oh, Tide Scooch is sickening. We've got a couple of friends here. Need, 
need more mana? Oh, need a little bit of health as well. Boom. Gosh, there are there are definitely some very profitable enemies in this area. Um Item requirements. Eight more decks. How can I get some more dexterity then in that case? Recovery, minions, intelligence. Oh, okay, so we can kind of go up to the right and get more mana in life, and then we'll go to deep wisdom, 10 intelligence, 10 dexterity, and then another 10 intelligence. Okay. This is, we're kind of, kind of figuring it out as we go. All right, let's go this way. We've got to, we've got to find our slave. Excellent. I wonder where she is. Honestly, I feel bad for her. And I'm kind of inclined to just let her go. I hope we don't have to fight her. I hope we can talk to her and reason with her. Like, do you, do you ever get that vibe when you're playing games and you're just like, you know what? I kind of get this person's point of view, so I would rather just, like, be their friend and just, like, sort out something, some sort of, like, sneaky side deal. Where it's like, you can keep whatever it is that you've got and just, like, you do you. Whoa! Strangle charm! Oh, I hope we get to save her. She's, like, th she's there in green. We can save. Ew, what are you? Are you a thing? Oh, she's already dead. Oh, man. I was hoping I could save her. Now I'm sad. A boulder? What do I do with the boulder? Oh, the ship graveyard. Oh, okay, so there's just like a sneaky way out. My Orphan, my blessed, damned Orphan. Oh. Yeah. You want your moment of my life now, do you? Unfortunately, in this oh, well, mate. Is, and for the all flame to give you. It's like, it's like, oh, for the all flame to, to be kindled, you're basically going to have to die. Dude, he has no idea who he is up against. You know what? It doesn't pain me at all. You're gonna be toasted, mate. I hope you... Ooh, an orb of alteration. I will take that. Look, Captain Fairgraves. You, you didn't have a single chance. Not against me. I am like a hundred times better than you at everything. All right, so we've got a corroded blade. I wonder how big that is. All right, so it's a three slaughter. All right, let's see if we can't shift a little of this around. Let's pick up that corroded blade. Your girl is smarter than she looks. Some days. On some days. She's smarter than she looks. Awesome. Um, Alright. So now we travel back to Lion's Eye. And I think we're just gonna... We're not gonna waste... Um, there we go. I hope you guys don't mind about that too much. Uh, we're not gonna waste a scroll... We're just going to go straight through the waypoint. Um, okay, cool. So let's go. Let's offload. Let's hand in our quest. Uh, let's actually um, sell our random goodies first. Ooh, gotcha. 
Hmm. Okay. Let's accept that and let's uh, quickly put everything back in its right place. Oh, I didn't sell the am amber amulet. I meant to do that. Accept. Alright, cool. Farewell. Um, we were holding on to that. And we're just going to throw this stuff into our bank. Glorious. So let's get um, our reward for doing that. Fairgrades was a good man. Fine explorer. He opened the door to many a new world. For better or for worse. Usually for worse when it came to magic. There's some peace in the knowledge that he now rests where he should. Let's not speak of Fairgrades again, shall we? He was an inspiration to many. It would be a shame to spoil a good hero. I feel like that's like a real... Oh, so we got a passive skill point. Awesome. That's really good. I feel like th that's like such an example of um, history is written by the victors. Because it's like, he was a massive douchebag. And then it's like, ah, oh, you know what? You know, he was a hero to a lot of people. So, lol. Just, just let him be a gigantic ass. Whatever. All right, so we're gonna do next two points. Uh, this ten to wind, and then do ten to dex, because for item requirements, we need eight more dex. Yas. All right then. So let's finish up this video with Captain Fairgraves's quest. So that's pretty cool. Uh, next time we continue on, we will be going to the Sirens' cadence and finding a way through the forest. Anyway. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you have any hints or tips for me, don't forget to leave it in the comments below. If you have any just general comments, hey, feel free, leave them. Have a chat. Um, I love, love, love listening to what you guys have to say. So yeah, it's, it's fantastic. Honestly, Path of Exile community, you guys are the best. All right. Mwah. Lots of love to you all. And I'll catch you guys really soon. Bye for now.